Hello fellow artists and welcome back to another video. So I I'm gonna to attempt to fix my sketchbook. It kind of all came apart. It's the Sea White of Brighton sketchbook and I'm not even halfway through yet. <laughs> so yeah the spine bit has all come off. Now I do actually have a book finding kit that my lovely friend Jasmine got me. Um, I think it was for my birthday. Or Christmas, I can't remember. So I'm going to use some of these products that are in here. So the glue, maybe the bone thing, not them. I have a pattern design. I'm going to try and use this grey board as well. I'm not sure how well that's going to work. Um, and maybe some of this paper that's included. Some of this paper, because I feel like it's kind of similar to the one that we have here. Yeah. I think the first step is to measure out this, one of these grey boards. Because when I look at the back end of this sketchbook here, just move that a bit, you can see that it is cardboard right there. So, and I think there was actually cardboard on this as well. So I'm not sure whether I should connect it to this. Maybe it curves round, I'm not too sure. So, obviously it's not going to work like that, but it will work this way. And maybe it'll it'll bend or something because it's kind of like gotta go upwards. Probably should have asked how to do this to start with. So the first thing I'm gonna do is probably measure the edges of this. So I'm probably gonna have to tear this a bit off so I can see that. And the same with this side. Yeah, I definitely will not be getting this brand of sketchbook again. <laughs> Because it, it's just not sturdy enough. Yep, so that seems about right. And then I'll mark, mark this bit here. And I'll draw a straight line. <laughs> if I can draw a straight line with a ruler. For some reason it's a lot harder than I thought drawing a straight line with a ruler. <laughs> don't know why. Right, so that's, that's about right. So now I'm going to cut this bit off where my scissors. I'm going to cut along here. If this fails and it doesn't work, I'm going to keep this video in and then I want someone to tell me how I should have done it. <laughs> right, that is about right there. So let's move this one as well. I can't see the other board. Well, actually, I can see it. So, I might have to tear this off. This is so sad. Oh my. Okay. I'm not sure how I'm going to cut that width. It's kind of right there. But I want it to like bend. So I don't know if to glue it flat or... Plus, there's paper that's gonna be on these bits. I should have kept the old, the old um, thing that I had to try and see what it, what it was like. I'll just cut another edge here. I'm going to see if this will work. You guys can all laugh at me in the comments if you like. I've never done a DIY fix a sketchbook before. <laughs> all right, so we have this piece. I'm going to curve it the best I can. In fact, I think it was just a mini piece and then the paper goes over the top of it. And it just connected, didn't it? So then it can still curve around. I think I'm understanding it now. Right, I've got my little spine bit and I'm going to glue it to this piece of paper paper that I have. So I'm going to use some of this PVA. Oops, oh great, I've just got glue all over that. Oh dear. Right, do I use the mini side? I'm going to use the mini side. Nope, I'm going to use the big side, I've changed my mind. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put a big layer of this on just to make sure that it stays in place. 
I have done a few book bindings, but not this type of book binding. I bet loads of you are cringing in the comments because you already know. Well, not, not in the comments, I mean just watching this because it's probably the wrong way to do it. Stick it down. Probably use one of those bone things in a minute. I can find where I put it. I'm losing everything. Oh, here it is. Right. And just press that down. I have all of this glued on now. I know it's not completely perfect, but I'm hoping this is going to work. <laughs> so, I think this slot's in here. Like so. And then the paper just glues to the back of it. So when I do that, it should have like sort of fixed itself. Yeah, I think that's correct. So now all I'll have to do is probably glue some of this to this. <laughs> but let me just crease them lines so you can see it needs to be folded. Right, I think I might have figured this out. But I don't know what to do when it comes to the top half, like the front of the sketchbook where all my stickers are, because I don't want to cover over my stickers. <laughs> so I'm going to glue all of the inside of, of this. So I probably should have done it on the other end instead of the outside. <laughs> so I'm going to have to do that again. Okay, so I'm just going to apply some more of this glue. inside of this cover. I was going to pattern it but I just thought no it'll look really weird because I don't have much patterned paper that would go with this so I just decided to keep it white. <laughs> Shall I get them edges? Okay I think that's probably okay. Right, moment of truth. <laughs> Will it work? Not so that folds. And that folds straight across. That does look okay. Oh, whoops! Nearly. <laughs> okay, steady, steady. I'm just gonna do that. Now the hardest part for me is this front part because I don't want it to, you know, ruin the stickers or anything. So I wonder if I can peel some of these stickers off and then re-stick them. Hopefully I can. So I'll be back when I've got to that bit. I got some of the stickers off and I uh, re-measured it so I know where it's going to stick. Now all I have to do is put some glue on here. So I'll be back once I've done that. Right, I've just got the all glue, the bit all glued together. So now I'm gonna pour it over and hopefully I've measured this correctly. There we go. I'm just gonna pat that down. Oh, you know, put it down so it's okay. Then I'll be able to stick my stickers back over it and that'll give some extra sturdiness. I might have to stick some glue on this one though, on this scroller box. There we go. I think I will now put that back on here, right at the edge where it was. And then same with the cat valk which went right there, ish, and then, well it probably was further up but never mind, and then I'll stick this one here. Alright, the moment of truth, let's see, so this is the outside of it, and the back as well, so hopefully when I open this to a page, doesn't 
obviously this bit probably could have been glued down but I'm all right with that I think it's it can lie flat like they're supposed to Let's pull it back over and yeah all right so I fixed my sketchbook <laughs> If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment down below what you think, did I go about it the right way, and yeah, subscribe for more, and I'll see you probably on Monday for a live stream, Monday or Tuesday, and yeah, okay, bye bye!